We are here at Salvation's Outdoor Festival in the Netherlands together with Ronald van Geldern. How are you doing? Doing just fine. Thank you very much. How are you doing? Tell me, um, one year without any releases. I mean, yeah. your last release was uh, Semper, Semper Fi, yeah, that's released right, on yeah. High Conference Recordings. Yeah. Yeah. Tell me, what, what have you been doing last year? Nothing. <laughs> no, no, no. We've been doing a lot. Um, actually, I decided after... Um, besides the fact... Let me start from the beginning. Um, I have a baby son, so I decided to take uh, some time off, about a year, to make sure that I can spend some time with him. Yeah. Uh, because the first two years are very important yeah. and um, next to that I was rebuilding my studio because I wasn't really satisfied with the whole acoustics and everything and um, after 12 years in making trends I felt it was time for something new yeah. because you know I was just I was fed up with um, you know there's so many trans producers and so many trans DJs it, you know in my opinion it was just too much yeah. uh, you know I and my goal in the whole music thing is always to stand out and be different than anybody else so I decided to you know um, how change do you say? your style yeah yeah, yeah to you're, change you're everything as a person in the DJ scene yeah you know just to lay low and watch the whole industry and see what happens and uh, so we're working in the studio now for a couple of months finished about 10 to 12 productions wow that's that's pretty much yeah it's a lot yeah and yeah. It, you know but it's it's nobody has heard anything yet you know it's like record companies everybody is asking me you know you know let us you know bring the productions let us hear something what we you know deliberately we're not doing that because you know i want to be sure that you know we have a few tracks that that i know that this is the way that i'm gonna go yeah. and you know I'm very sorry for the whole trans community, but you know, it's just after 12 years, I really, to, to you know, to keep evolving myself as an artist and as a producer, I just need to do something else, you know? And then what made you want to do that? I mean, you have been a, like a rocker for many years now, yeah. the yeah. rock person from the whole dance industry. Yeah. Are we seeing this as well in the new you? I don't know yet, you know, like I said before, like I said to you, the, uh, you know, just, just, just a minute ago is that, um, I'm working on a whole new alter ego thing and um, you know it's you know for me it's when you produce music and when you're an artist you really have to be the artist yeah. and you have to bring the people something special and it's not just about arriving no. putting on the record and you know do some mixing for two hours and then go you know you have to be the entertainer you have to make sure that the crowd is satisfied it's your whole repertoire okay. yeah you know it's the whole thing and um, you know a lot of people were talking for the for the last five years about the whole image thing yeah, you know, and, and I'm definitely gonna come up with something new, yeah. something special, but um, I don't know exactly what yet, but you know, now um, we're almost to the point that we're gonna launch the whole thing. Yeah. When? When is it coming? Well, we, we're, you know, we are thinking about September and October, yeah. you know, in that line. Um, you know, and I'm really excited because yeah. it's something completely new, you know, and yeah. but, I, but the thing is, I don't want to hype it too much because then people are gonna expect everything. Yeah. And then, you know, the expectations yeah. are that high, they're always gonna go like, oh, okay, you know, yeah. so I just want to keep it really on the down low and see yeah. what's gonna happen. Yeah, all right, well, I'm gonna follow you as much as possible. Well, and thank you I'll so take much, you for man. the interview. <laughs> thank you. Bye-bye.